have another story about wild animals. And uh, this one is about the golden lion tamarind comes home. So we're going to read about a tamarind. I know it'll look like a monkey and it looks like a lion, but it's something else. So it's a golden lion tamarind. Uh, they're really cute. And Connor, show them a picture. Connor's going to be uh, filming it today. Right, buddy? Yep. My wife's a little, uh, a little tired with the COVID and a little sick. So Connor's going to film. All right, buddy, let's do it. All right. Rescue in the rainforest. Background and vocabulary. So the words you're going to be doing your sheet on are captive, dilemma, extinction, habitat, reintroduction. The home in the gold line, Tamarind comes home, is the coastal rainforest of Brazil. It provides a habitat of, for a great variety of animals. Even though, as the map on the right shows, you show the map where the Brazil that is, the rainforest has been reduced to a fraction of its original size. How did this happen? When human beings move into an area, their need for food and shelter may conflict with the needs of animals who make their home there. As they lose their habitat to human development, Animals like the golden lion tamarind may even face extinction. This creates a dilemma. How to allow for development without threatening wildlife? There is hope. The reintroduction of captive tamarinds into the wild may help their numbers grow in what remains of the rainforest. Who is doing this work? Where does the work begin and end? The answers are in the golden lion tamarind comes home. There you can see the pictures of people tearing down that beautiful rainforest. Turn the page. Meet the author photographer, George and Connor, future traveler. As a boy, and Connor visited the East River docks in New York City with his father. Watching freighters from around the world sparked an interest in other countries. Study abroad. While well, in art school, Encana traveled to southern Mexico, where he met his parents' families for the first time. Early work. Before Encana became a photographer, he worked for a carpenter, a mechanic, and at an amusement park. Da, 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 da. In his own words, I think people are fascinating, and I love to find myself in strange places, meeting people getting to know them, and learning about them. This helps me to learn about myself. Other titles. Let's see. That's, these may be not as bad. And Connor's books reflect his love of travel and other cultures. Turtle Watch and Carnival also take place in Brazil. And Pablo Remembers was photographed in Mexico. All right, so now you're going to do your vocabulary sheath. Then we're going to read the story, and then you're going to do comprehension work. All right, so you can pause the video, Connor. Hit the button. Mm 